Dying stars another one of the screen's great dames, Ida Pino. The film is called While the City Sleeps, and it was released by RKO Radio Pictures in 1956, 12 years after Lang made our last movie. Now, this is one of two films that Fritz Lang always included among his personal favorites, the other being Fury, which was the first film Lang directed in the United States after going to Hollywood. And when you see our movie, While the City Sleeps, you'll really understand why Lang regarded it so highly. It's very good. The movie starts with a murder, but it's definitely not your typical whodunit. As a matter of fact, pretty much from the start, you know who the killer is, but you don't know if or how the killer will be caught and how many other people will get snuffed out along the way. The centerpiece of the movie is a major metropolitan newspaper, and you get to meet many of the tough guys and tough women who work there. And get a load of this cast, along with Ida Lupino, the film stars Dana Andrews, Vincent Price, George Sanders, Rhonda Fleming, Thomas Mitchell, James Craig, Howard Duff, who was Ida Lupino's husband at the time, and also John Barrymore Jr., the son of the great John Barrymore and the father of today's Drew Barrymore. So here from 1956, a real goodie, directed by Fritz Lang, While the City Sleeps. At the time she made this movie, Ida Lupino was making waves not only as an actress, but also as a film director. She was one of the few women who had been able to get into that boys club in Hollywood. And something else Ida did besides direct was start her own company, which she called Filmmakers. Ida Lupino put several new actors under personal contract and nurtured them, hoping to help them build careers in Hollywood. And one of the first people she signed was Sally Forrest, who played the secretary Nancy, the bait, in While the City Sleeps. Sally Forrest starred in two of Ida Lupino's films, Not Wanted and Hard, Fast and Beautiful. Up next on TCM, Dana Andrews, directed by Fritz Lang again, but this time it's Dana with Joan Fontaine. <laughs> 